everybody and welcome back to Frugal Farron. Today I'm doing a collab video with a fellow YouTuber. She's a small YouTuber as well, um, Mila B Beauty. I hope I said that right. We actually only know each other through um, Instagram and YouTube. We've never met in person. We have Skype before. She's super nice, awesome. I love her videos. And so today we're doing a Never Have I Ever challenge with each other through the internet. So I'm filming my video, she's filming hers, and then we're going to link the ones that down below for the other person. So I really hope you like this. We're asking the same questions and we're gonna be doing the same thing. If you do enjoy this, please give it a thumbs up or subscribe, really appreciate it. And I'm gonna go ahead and get started. So I have all the questions on my phone because we, uh, we did them through Instagram DM. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and start with these. Number one, have I ever had a summer job? I've had a job through the whole year. I've never had just a summer job. So all 10 finger, uh, all 10 still up. Number two, accidentally said I love you to someone. Yes, I've said I love you to multiple people. I just automatically say it at the end of my phone calls with most of my friends and family members that I just say I love you and I've said it to people that I, yeah, I don't need to say it to. Number three, have you ever been out of the country? Yes, I have been out of the country. I've actually um, been to Mexico, I've been to um, Italy, I've been to Bar uh, Barbados, I've been to the Philippines, I've been to Japan. Um, yeah, so I've been out of the country. I love traveling. So anytime I can travel, I just want to do it. So yes, I have been out of the country. So I'm already down to seven. Wait, so I'm already down to eight. This is going to be interesting. I do know the questions, but I haven't like actually thought through the questions. So because we just kind of picked them. <laughs> Number four, have you ever borrowed a sibling's clothes without asking? Well, no. I borrowed my mom's clothes, <laughs> uh, but I don't think I've ever borrowed a sibling. I mean, I have a brother, so it's not like we can just, oh, hey, he's got a cute dress in there I can borrow <laughs> kind of thing. Uh, I, I'm sure I've, I've borrowed his like basketball shorts and stuff, but I've always asked him, so no, I don't think so. Number five, made a prank call. I have never made a prank call. Um, actually, for one of my birthdays, I had a sleepover when I was young, the wee little lad, and um, I fell asleep at my own birthday party. I was the first one asleep, actually I was the only person asleep, and apparently everybody else started making phone calls. The police got sent to my house, and my mom like went all crazy, not really, she actually was really calm and nice about it. Um, so my mom like tried to figure out what happened, and while I was asleep, people so I never actually did it, but I've been there for other people making prank calls. So I'm going to say no. Number six, have you ever lied about your age? No, I don't think so. I can't, or I don't know of anything that I would have. So, no. Number seven, have you ever ridden an animal? Yes. Um, I've ridden a horse. I've ridden a dog when I was a little baby. Um, I've ridden, what's the other one? I'd, I've ridden on a, a buffalo, a, a water buffalo in the Philippines. And I think that's it for animals I've ridden. Yeah. Number eight, have you ever had a surprise party thrown for you? Yes, multiple times. Um, my biggest surprise party that was thrown for me was for my 16th birthday, my mom threw one. Uh, and it was super awesome. It was a t breakfast at Tiffany's theme and I had no idea until I walked in and there were like 200 people there and I was like, whoa. Um, so it, it was really, really cool. Number nine, have you ever snuck into a movie? I have not snuck into a movie. I've, I'm, that does, just doesn't really interest me. Like I'm gonna pay for something to do it. Um, so number 10, have you ever thrown up on a roller coaster? No, I've never thrown up on a roller coaster. I do love roller coasters. Um, I've actually th thrown up after a roller coaster, but not actually on a roller coaster. And thank goodness I have never been on a roller coaster when someone else throws up too, because I would just, I don't, I'm one of those people, 
You either hear it, you smell it, you see it, you throw up. So, yeah, I didn't, I haven't thrown up on a roller coaster. Number 11, have you, never have I ever been trapped inside an elevator. I actually have been inside of an elevator, so three down. I got trapped inside the elevator when I was pretty young, maybe like 11 or 12, maybe? I'm not completely sure about that. Um, but the elevator stopped working and literally we were in the middle of the floors. So the elevator stopped working. It was halfway between one floor and the next. So we ended up having, we opened the doors, we pulled them open and you could see the wall for the bottom half and then you could see the level above it and we actually crawled out which I know you're not supposed to do and it, looking back at it that was such a bad idea because like what if it did start working we would have somebody would have probably died but um anyway but we crawled out there was like six or seven of us I know like my mom and dad were there and stuff and yeah we just you know we crawled out the top of it and decided to take the stairs but it was a little scary and okay number 12 is never have i ever had a long distance relationship never had a long distance relationship um i mean like friendships yes but not um an actual dating relationship i've always dated people pretty close to me so within the same state for sure and then within the same like 30 miles from me like yeah i would say around like 30 miles for me is like the most for 13 seasick Okay, so I actually have not gotten seasick. I definitely have felt it before. Um, I guess, I don't know if that counts as the same thing. Where you feel sick, but you don't actually get sick. You know what, I'll count it. So I have four down, so I'm at six now. Um, yeah, I, I guess I'll count that. I've never been like sick sick from it. Like I've never thrown up from it or anything, but I've definitely been like nauseated and just ugh. Don't like that feeling. I get car sickness though, so I guess it kind of makes sense that I would get seasickness a little bit. Never have I ever cried or flirted my way out of a ticket. No, I've never cried or flirted my way out of a ticket. In fact, my very first ticket, I actually have only had one ticket. I got a warning once because I went the wrong way in one way. And I took it really well. I mean, it was, I understood. I, I mean, obviously I was doing it wrong. So I get it. Um, I did, however, get one ticket, and that was someplace I've never been. I was speeding so I could get home because I was gone for the weekend. Me and a friend were in the car, and I wasn't paying attention to the speed limit at all. I was honestly just trying to get home. Both of our phones had died. We were using, like, legitimate maps. Like, we had, I thank goodness I have folded up maps in my car, and which I actually prefer that over GPS because me and technology just don't get along. But... We had maps out and I'm, we, she's like helping me navigate. I'm like looking and I'm like, where in the world is the highway? Cause we had to get off the highway cause there was a big accident. It was just crazy. So I was speeding and I got caught. And I mean, I took it like a man cause I don't, you know, I got it. Like I, I did it. It's not like I can be like, I wasn't speeding. No, like I, I did it. And there's no point in crying about it. I, sure, they got me. <laughs> And I didn't even try to flirt with them. I, no, I, I'm not good at that, so it doesn't work. Number 15, never have I ever taken a bad fall because I was walking and texting. No, no, I don't think I have. Um, not walking and texting. I fall all the time, but that's because I'm clumsy. Um, but it's not like specifically because I'm walking and texting. Like I broke my ankle because I was walking. Like literally I walked into a hole. So, yeah, hashtag my life. Uh, I, I'm always broken. I always did something because I'm just clumsy. I have bruises on me. I have no idea where they came from. Okay, number 16. Um, never have I ever been skydiving. I actually have been skydiving, so I'm down to five. Um, I loved it so much. Um, I actually told my mom the day uh, before that, I, or no, actually the day of I went uh, skydiving and I was like hey I'm going skydiving this morning and you know blah 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 um, I went by myself it was super fun I had I actually met a lady there she was um, in her 80s and she was just doing her bucket list and it was she was the nicest person I've ever met she was super fun super friendly I have a whole bunch of pictures with her actually because it was it was awesome I really enjoyed doing it 
um, especially with her, it made it a lot more fun. But yeah, it was it was pretty cool. Never have I ever had a bad allergic reaction. I don't think I've ever had a bad re No, I'm not allergic really to anything. So I would say no. My mom's highly allergic to bees and I've never been stung. So I might be allergic to bees, but I don't know. So, so I think this is the last question. Um, never have I ever had embarrassing video of me uploaded to social media. Um, I don't think I have an embarrassing video. I guess I technically have a slightly embarrassing video. I'll link it down in the description below. Um, it's actually from the Philippines and we were catching wild chickens. But, um, they weren't, we couldn't catch any of the wild ones because they were crazy fast. So, uh, we actually, I caught one on a chain, which kind of defeats the purpose. It's not like it can get away from me, but it, it was fun. Um, and so my friend posted that video uh, of me. So I'll, I'll link that down below for you guys to see it. And I mean, it's, it's a video. It's fun. So I guess I, I ended up with four left over. So yeah, four. There we go. Uh, that's actually pretty good. I'm not sure how hers are gonna turn out. We'll see and I'm really excited to see her video um, Hers will be linked down below as soon as I know the link I'll put it down at the bottom in the description box and I hope you have a wonderful day. Thank you